So the next theme we'll be talking about is recruitment and patriotism. Uh, and we'll also talk about a sub-theme in there as well about using women in advertising. So Europe had been at war for quite some time when the United States got involved in 1917. And again, the government had to change public perception and, and public opinion of why we were fighting. So for, an, for the entire time that the war was going on in Europe, the United States did not want to get involved. And there were a lot of people in favor of that stance. So when we did, the United States did declare war in 1917, they had to now ask people, we want your sons to join the military to go fight in this war. We're also going to need your money in these loans, these liberty loans and, and liberty bonds. And we want you to also change the way you're living. You're going to need to ration. So all these things were happening that they had to change people's perception in order to support the war so they could raise more money and have their sons fight. And so this one, and this particular poster is by Howard Chandler Christie. Uh, this is actually probably the second most popular poster for the war. The first, of course, being uh, Uncle Sam with his finger pointing at you, uh, we want you, and, or I want you. So this one is, gee, I wish I were a man, I'd join the Navy. Uh, be a man and do it. United States Navy Recruiting Station, and this was in Kansas City. And this was an, a poster from early on. You'll see the date on here as 1917. So again, this was the second most popular poster. They're asking men to join the cause, join the fight. Uh, again, this was also the first time in advertising, uh, in marketing, that women were used, uh, both women and children. And you'll see a couple of examples with the children. Uh, you already saw two examples of women and children being used for, for the fear, the scare tactic uh, that were um, used and painted by uh, or created by Raleigh. So you have this one that was for recruitment. But there's also, if you notice the colors, uh, red, white, and blue. So very patriotic. Uh, if you look at this one, these aren't so much um, recruitment like the Christie poster, but these are definitely using, again, red, white, and blue. You'll see patriotic themes with the, the banner behind uh, the mother who's saying, women, help America's son win the war. Definitely playing on emotion uh, and, and your heartstrings with, with that. Uh, and in this one, it almost gets lost. You'll see the poster that's very patriotic, but if you look close in the background, you'll see the battlefields. You'll see the war behind her. Uh, they definitely wanted to make her front and center, but you can definitely see the scenes of war from behind her. Um, this one... We do not have Uncle Sam's I Want You poster in our collection. That's probably one of the few that we don't have. Uh, what we do have is this one where there's two children uh, along with Uncle Sam, and it's saying, boys and girls, you can help your Uncle Sam win the war. Save your quarters and buy war savings bonds. So they were actually advertising marketing to little children in this to, to the youth of America at the time. And again, using red, white, and blue, using Uncle Sam to convey this message 